the day we're going to the Hamptons. I'm going to use my new face really quickly. Okay, so one side is done. I'm not sure if you can tell the difference. It is so subtle. You see how like this cheekbone is going up a little bit more compared to this one? I don't know if you can see that or if it's just me. Maybe it's a placebo effect, who knows? I really need to clean this closet up so I can find more of this stuff because there was like some stuff that I found and I was like, oh, I forgot I had this. Check this out. Woo, shine bright like a diamond. Wow. You guys did a phenomenal job. This looks so good. <gasps> Look how cute. Oh That's yes, vibe. Good morning. I am sweating up a storm over here. Let me get a towel. Good morning. Um, it is, what day is it? Tuesday. Came downstairs to do a Peloton. My downstairs gym area is a hot mess because we are going through like old baby stuff and like old toys and everything this looks a mess so i had to clean some stuff i had to clean like an area so i can work out i couldn't work out with daryl this morning because he only had a nine o'clock and today we're going to the hamptons so i need to pack i always feel like i have nothing to wear with a closet full of clothes and get the kids to camp right now but i wanted to just get a quick workout in i had so many margaritas this weekend that i was like i need to sweat like i need to really sweat it out i'm getting everybody's lunch boxes ready i'm trying to do breakfast making sure i don't burn my mom's toast but i don't even think she's up so i'm gonna have to go upstairs and make sure she is up and ready to go is it's so quiet it's about 8 35 Leonard should be up by now oh you know what the kids slept together so if they slept together that means they never wake up on time so this is London's breakfast I'm gonna put some toast on here too she loves toast and butter and this bread by um bread alone is so good yeah this is it right here it's a very, very good bread. However, it does perish um, very quickly because it's so fresh. It literally has um, one, two, three, four, five ingredients. So I love this bread. I get it from the farmer's market and they sell it at Whole Foods too. And then for butter, we only use ghee. I prefer ghee. It is very pricey, but it is a good fat butter. Um, and I genuinely just really like it. All right, so this is just a little breakfast. Now I'm gonna go and wake up London. I think Rio put his mattress in London's room. So they're definitely sleeping together. But I just do some toast in the morning, some walnuts, watermelon, and strawberry. Okay, let me get the lunch boxes ready. Lunch is served. So for today, London is here getting ready for camp. This is Rio's, this is London's. We're doing a tortilla wrap with almond butter. Strawberries, mango, a little treat, vegetables. And a nail polish painted tree. And a nail polish painted tree. And then for real, we're gonna do tofu, hummus, veggies, some chips, and some little snacks because they are both like different things. And then we're gonna get into Lyndon's hair really quickly and we gotta get here out of here in five minutes. Let me get that towel, son. Love me, love me, see that you love me. All right, you ready to go? I'll see you when I get back in a few days. Bye. Bye guys, have a great day at camp. We got one kid down, the other one is still sleeping. I need to make a smoothie, so let's get in here. Let's make a smoothie. I also need a coffee. I need a coffee. I feel like once I get the kids out of the house, I start becoming lazy and slowing down, and I need to like keep this energy, you know? Making my smoothie, Rio is still sleeping. I'm gonna bend down so you guys can see me, but I'm gonna try these Metabolism Super Powders by Saqqara. You guys know I love myself some Saqqara. I just love their probiotics, which comes to, I just thought about it, I didn't take any this morning. So I think I showed these to you last time, but these are the probiotics that I take. And I'm gonna take these now, and then I'm gonna use the metabolism super powder it's supposed to be great for relieving bloat and inflammation and really firing up your metabolism so i'm into all those things and then i got some new protein powder sent to me in a little gifting package 
Um, I've used this company before. It's called Elixir Co. Their very first protein powder, I randomly found it and I was like, wow, this is delicious. I think they came out with this new one. So I'm gonna give this one a shot and see how it goes. But I just think with protein powders, you really have to read them because they have a lot of junk in them. And I'm just kind of like, what? Why is there so much junk in here? All right, so I don't know if this is gonna taste good at all. Because usually this is like a chocolate base. Usually when I have that, I mix it with cherries, uh, frozen cherries, and it's so good. So I'm just gonna do strawberries, because strawberries go with chocolate, right? We're gonna put one pack of this. I put, I tried this before. I wanted to do like a two week metabolism situation, and I just didn't make it. Like, <sighs> sometimes I just can't commit, you know? And there's only three grams of protein in here. And for me, that's not enough because I work out. I need the protein. And I have such a predominantly a plant-based diet that I need to get the protein when I can, when I'm lifting weights. You know, I want to be, make sure I'm staying healthy. All right, I'm not going to put a whole, a whole thing in there. What else goes with chocolate? Banana. Let's put a banana in here. Should we put some almond butter? No, we have a lot of protein. Okay. It smells like pure chocolate. Let's give this a try. Look at that perfect cup. Here we go. Decent. Mm. Rio's up. Good morning, sweetie. Daddy's not here. You're just talking to mommy. This is pretty good. I can deal with this. Daddy? He took sis to camp. Sis left you because she had to go to camp. Sis leaves so fast. She didn't leave that fast, baby. She didn't leave that fast at all. Where are you going? I want applesauce. You want applesauce? Early in the morning, you have to have what? Look at these little buns. Let me see these buns. Does sis put those man buns in your hair? Mm -hmm. How many do you have? One, two. I made you a really nice um, lunch, but let's get ready for, you have to go to school too. Applesauce. No, you cannot have it. You have to have water first. First water, then you can have an applesauce, okay? All right, I am just getting out of the shower and like I am running behind today and I need a coffee. We have to do some work, but real quick. What else you doing? Oh wait, hold on. Hold up. I just got an email guys and someone offered me a trip to Paris business class. I'm like, yes, because guess what? It is going to be fashion week in September and I need a flight. So, please note that the following dates will not have, oh, boo. Let's jump in here. So, I'm going to use my new face really quickly, get some of these like laugh lines up just a bit, but I use the gel primer. To be honest with you, you don't really need to use their gel. I was talking to my facialist. I like how I'm like all fancy. My facial, I used her once and now she's my facialist. I used her once and she was like spilling the tea on everything and she was like you don't have to use this gel the gel is just you can use like a sonogram gel and be happy with it next time around because the gel is a little bit pricey i'll just get some sonogram gel and when i'm done take it off my face okay so one side is done I'm not sure if you can tell the difference. It is so subtle. Obviously the new face is something you have to like use all the time. So I did this side and I feel like it gives you like a tiny little, you see how like this cheekbone is going up a little bit more compared to this one. I don't know if you can see that or if it's just me. Maybe it's a placebo effect, who knows? But I feel like my face is feeling a little tighter on this side. <clears throat> now I'm gonna do this side and my forehead, I do this every day for about five minutes and it's just to like, give me a snatch. You know what I'm saying? We gotta snatch that face. Snatch it girl, snatch it. 
surprise we are in my closet and you know what we have got to pack guys we have got to pack so i went and grabbed a coffee this closet is literally as per usual looking a hot mess okay so we have a dress code ahead of time not a dress code but like i have a schedule of where we're going so let me pull that up so that i know what to pack all right since we're going to the hamptons it's not a very like high heel situation because there's pebbles and rocks everywhere we'll bring one pair just in case um because there's nothing worse than feeling like you're underdressed. I'd rather be overdressed than underdressed. So let's pull up this schedule, Hana. I got so many emails. I'm over here. I'm moving like molasses. We have a little dinner this evening. Okay, so dinner can be like a chic situation. Like maybe like a cute cocktail dress or something. Dress code is Hampton chic. I like that they put that there. Tomorrow, we're going to do yoga. So we need a yoga outfit. Maybe we're going to be walking around in our yoga outfits. Then we have picnic lunch. Casual. So make, let's make that cute and casual. Maybe shorts and a shirt. Cocktail. Okay, so we need two dresses, one outfit, and a, and a yoga. I went to Zimmerman and tried on a bunch of stuff. So I ended up getting this really cute yellow situation. Neon yellow cut out a dress so this could be a vibe then i got those white chic like pants <sighs> i think these are really cute we just need a top with this maybe we can just do like some sort of a black bodysuit all right let's not make this an all-day situation right let's just find something to wear and get out of here let me look through my closet and figure out what it is that i need and then I'm going to get back to you before I even pack it. All right, guys. I feel like I am going way too far into this. And I'm just packing way too much, okay? So there's some oldies that I've found in my closet that are cute. Like, they are vibe. I really need to clean this closet up so I can find more of this stuff. Because there was, like, some stuff that I found and I was like, oh, I forgot I had this. So I'm doing this old Zimmerman outfit. I wore this to Fashion Week, like, four years ago. And you know what? It's still beautiful. So I'm gonna do this, this. I'm gonna bring this skirt and just in case I don't wanna wear, so there's this skirt here and this skirt goes with this shirt, but just in case that doesn't work, I can always mix and match something like that. I'm trying to hurry up because I want to go get my eyebrows threaded really quickly. I did get micro blading a while back, um, but I still, you know, the new growth that comes in. I didn't want to pluck it myself because between me and you, when I pluck my eyebrows, it makes me feel like I want to throw up. It is the most bizarre situation, but it literally makes me queasy. So do we want to bring these Tory Burch flats or should we bring Chloe? How are we feeling? Check this out. Bringing this silk top, I think that we need a really nice gold necklace to go with it. So I'm going to bring this beautiful top to go with, it could go with this or it could go with these white pants. But the white pants, look what I found. This beautiful sheer tie-dye situation. This feels very Dior, right? Like very like the tie-dye look. All right, so... I'm going to bring this as well, and I'm going to, like, open it up just a bit. I can't wait to style this for you guys. And I'm also going to bring this orange bodysuit in case that blue one doesn't look good. Got to have bodysuit options. God, wait a minute. I feel like I'm out of outfits here. This was the Zimmerman top that matched the skirt. So I feel like we can do something with this. So far, we have one, two, three outfits right? I think that's good. I think we're good. Three outfits and um, should I bring a pair of shorts and a blazer just in case? We need workout clothes. Let's get workout clothes. Okay, so I'm going to bring these and I really like these Roger Vivier shoes. I think that these could be a really cute chic vibe. So let's bring those and I'm also going to bring my black Hermes sandals. Since I'm going to an event with another brand, I didn't want to bring other brands that are like so flashy. I feel like it's kind of like eh, a little faux pas for you to be doing that. 
Um, it's just like out of respect, you know what I mean? It's like you can't go to Chanel and then show up with Prada head to toe. It's just like, you know, respect. I respect you, I see you. And then I think I'm gonna wear these shorts, maybe an over, I don't know, maybe a, some t-shirt and a blazer. And that's it. I'm gonna go uh, find some workout clothes, throw this all in a bag, and then let's get out of here. Hello lovelies, I just got to my room and I want to give you a quick little tour. So, all of these amazing things come with my room. My husband would be so happy to see this. And then, I have this little seating area over here which is a living room situation. Bottle of champagne with two glasses, but it's only a party of one, so. And then, let's go over here. You have me. Hello darlings. Let's see, anything in here? Oh, robes, another mirror, yes. And then a bathroom. The lighting in here is impeccable, by the way. Perfect for skincare. So I have one bathroom there. This is a suite that they treated me to, so this is really nice. And then I'm gonna move on to my bedroom. I have this big bed to myself, and this is what I have. Uh, they sent over some accessories and things. I have a little schedule with my name on it, a little scarf situation, my bags. And then, yes, let's get into this. Got a new little um, cosmetic bag. This is great for carrying skincare, all of Dior's uh, amazing, amazing um, fragrances and skincare. Look at this. I'm currently, it's so funny because I just bought this one in my bag. Um, so I brought that and then I got another one. So I'm really happy about this because this is bomb.com. I'm definitely going to try out the eye serum. These are all such amazing goodies. And then let's get into the bathroom. Look how nice this is. All right, the, this fogs up because I ended up opening this, this window, but there is another mirror. I know, I know it's funny when I say mirror. And then look at this. This whole thing opens up. How nice is this so you can take a shower? Am I right? And then I have a whole seating area upstairs as well. Why don't we go take a look at that? Love this for us, right? Let's go upstairs and check this out. This lighting. <laughs> Yes, queens, this lighting is something else. We are, this is a vibe. This is a vibe for us, I'm loving it here. And also, I am two days off with no kids. Really loving it here, really loving it. Look at this pool. Nice pool situation. This is like a really nice place to just come out and meditate. It's nice and quiet. And then this is my seating area. How great is this? Well, my um, umbrella is down right now because it's pretty windy, but this is just such a nice space overall. And then we're gonna have, keep things super easy. We're gonna have dinner here downstairs um, at 6.30. So I think what I'm gonna do right now is just work a little bit, try and transfer some footage, um, put up some posts that need to go up, and I have some things that are due today. So work, work, work. I wanted to walk over to town and see if I can grab a bathing suit because of course I forgot mine. I don't know what I was thinking. Hopefully I can go over there and grab a bathing suit. If not, it looks like the schedule is pretty tough and like I'm not gonna have any time to go swimming anyway. But you never know, you just wanna be prepared. All right guys, so I'll see you at dinner tonight. Ciao. on the beach I forgot my vlogging camera but um, we are doing a workout a hit yoga class today it is absolutely 
beautiful out here. Dior skincare is like nailing it with this trip. All right, look at my boo over here. She's like our mom. Hi, mom. We're all done. Everyone is just kind of like hanging out. We're about to put on our shoes, go back to the hotel, grab some breakfast. I'll get my vlogging camera and start the rest of our day. Just got to the beautiful Dior skincare event and we have to go inside because we're gonna talk about all things skincare. So let's go inside and then I'll bring you guys back out and show you what is going on. It's a beautiful day. Then in the morning, and that was perfect question, we want the puffing motions in, out, and in, out. Okay, never that, never in, the, just always out. I, to be on a safe side, I always would do from in, out. That's okay. the puffing motion, mm. yes. The position. Yes, Got and it. then you can bring it down to the link notes. If you are playing with your own tool and nobody else touches it, so always, because just finishing here, that's not enough. That's sometimes when they do those anti-redness lasers and they do a little patches here, and then uh, three weeks later, you're all red. Because blood flow, we have such a cardiovascular system on our face that just touching a, a little centimeter of a capillary, that's not enough. That's exactly when we talk about puffiness, we, Talk about the whole area, bringing it down. Even you can press here, press here, bring it down to the lymph nodes, all the groups of lymph nodes. Mm -hmm. The lymph nodes, so are I, they just, do they just drain the puffiness? They drain, that's only, that's only area how we can really drain. Okay. Yes, yes. All right, so we just finished a little chat with Joanna. And now we are going to have some lunch. Everyone is here looking fabulous. You look so cute oh and God, chic. Thanks. Look at this one. My little belly shirt. Look at your Hampton chic. chic. Yes, ma'am. I got two <laughs> phones. <gasps> look how cute. I didn't see this over here. Cute, right? Yes. Wait, let me take a photo. Alright, we've been chilling outside for a little bit, so I'm a little bit hot and have sunscreen all over my face, but I'm going into town because I actually forgot a bathing suit. So I'm off to go grab a bathing suit, I'm going to go swim for about two hours, then go back to the hotel, change, shoot some content, and get ready for dinner tonight. So just want to update you guys and show you what I'm doing but for the most part just kind of it's such a very relaxed trip I'm loving every last minute of it because sometimes brands can really pack a schedule but this is really nice that they're just kind of allowing us to like really enjoy the moment and uh, learn so much about the about the brand about the skincare brand and um, you know I'm gonna enjoy a facial a little bit tomorrow but so far so good I just tried on two outfits. I'm gonna get this really cute short dress and this bathing suit. And then I gotta get out of here because it's, it's like, I can't even get this on the hanger. It's like taking me so long. <laughs> but um, also today I am wearing these wide leg Zimmerman trousers that I tried on earlier this week. And then um, I forgot where this top is from, but it's so pretty and I got it last summer, never wore it. And now I found like it was the perfect timing to wear that, especially with this light blue uh, Dior bag. But let me pay and get out of here. Got the vlog. Hey guys, I'm back here, I'm shooting. I'm just gonna put this camera up just so you can kind of see what is going on. So essentially like the shots is you grabbing this. So as soon as you grab it, I'll just say reset. You put it back and we'll just keep doing that a couple of times. Okay. All right, action. The boys are leaving. We just created magic. Magic. In, Thanks to you. In like 30 minutes. And you can feel things now, so it's good. And now I can feel. <laughs> I'm feeling really happy. I'm getting ready to actually now film a video. I'm finished shooting. Now I'm getting dressed because I need to be downstairs in like 10 minutes to go to dinner. However, I'm looking for mousse for my hair because my flyaways are like, girl. 
just do something with those flyaways, but I cannot find. I thought I bought, oh, it's in the drawer. Where should it be? Okay, um, let me get into this outfit. I'm wearing Dior today. It's just fancy when I say that. I'm wearing Dior today. Get into this skirt, and then if I open up this door, you guys can see the shimmer. Check this out. Woo, shine bright like a diamond. And then I have the black to match, and I went with flats because it is Hampton chic instead of heels because you kind of can't walk around the Hamptons in heels, let's be honest. I actually did not pick this look out. Dior picked it out for me, and I think it's really cute. And you know what would also look good with this outfit? What would be a vibe? Actually, if we swap the sweater, because it is a little bit warm, if we swap the sweater and gave it a nice Dior white button down with the flats, could be a vibe. Look at this view. All you see is my skirt. <laughs> yes, yes, girl, yes. Oh my God, this is a vibe. Okay, my hair is looking crazy. The thing is, it is rather warm and I'd rather wear my hair up. I'm just gonna do a low pony, maybe a bun. And call it a day because I'm hot as hell. I'm struggling. Uh-oh, I gotta go. See you at dinner. This is looking like vibes. Sorry to interrupt. This looks beautiful. Wow, you guys did a phenomenal job. Thank you. This looks so good. Oh yes, vibe. Last night was fun. I woke up at, sorry, I'm looking at myself in the mirror. My hair is, um, I've got like the messy, the messy vibe. But last night was really fun. Hung out with the uh, Dior beauty team. I love how diverse it is. I feel like, like, let's give Dior skincare a thumbs up because they really nailed it. Me and Valaria ended up having breakfast this morning and then she left. And I have to pack up all of this mess. Like I feel like my stuff is everywhere. So I'm gonna pack up and I have a facial with Joanna at um, 11.30. And then I'm gonna come back here and I'm gonna be homeless for a bit. So I'm just gonna have to kind of like hang around for a few hours because the next event is not till five o'clock. So I'm probably gonna have like four hours of just like chilling. So I, I, I'm gonna need something to do. But that's it for now. Let me pack up and then I'll see you guys in a little bit. Heavenly. <laughs> <laughs> I love this like after massage when we freeze the cheeks through this. It's like an automatically laugh. <laughs> right? <laughs> yes. I want to show you the less glamorous side of things. So I got a facial earlier. Of course, my camera is going to go dead, but 
I'm in a bathroom and I don't have a room anymore. So I have Guess what? I also got here and they had my shoes ready. How beautiful are these? Yes, it's a vibe, guys. And then I brought Ami with me. Look how cute she is. Say hello, darling. Hello. She's looking absolutely fantastic. Yes, queen. All right, then we have Rebecca, Tina Marie. Hi, girl. You guys look beautiful. Oh, just to start it off, can you hold on to these? I'm using the ones right here. Oh! Wow. You may take one. You can look at it, you can show it to the camera, to the guys. Now, everything I do happens rather quickly, to the point where you can put your car back inside, and it'll come right back on top. And it'll come right back on top. As fast as that Ada Hearts is, there it is. Any slower, we're just watching that change. Oh, guys, guess what? I'm on my phone. I can't um, vlog from my, my, uh, I'm, just, I'm so tired. I cannot vlog from my vlogging camera because it's upstairs and I am so tired. So check this out. I have a little story. Last night when we were in the Hamptons at Rachel Zoe's event, us, usy, I lost my phone. <laughs> so I lose my phone. There was like this big mix up with like car service and everything. I lose my phone. Uh, Rachel Zoe's husband, Roger, nicest person alive, literally was like with me and, and someone else was with me, like literally looking all over the place for my phone. He's like calling it. He's like, everybody, please be quiet so we can hear the phone ring. And then finally it dawned on me that I was in another car service and my stuff was in there and I took my stuff out to put my stuff in another car and my phone was in my hand. So I must have put my phone down, grab my stuff. And then that car left on its way to New York. So I desperately needed my phone because of the content I took that night. It was an ad, so it needed to go live, right? So now it's like that event, I was the last person to leave because I had to call the girl who was in the car and uh, my friend had her number. So luckily my friend had her number. Call the girl, ask her to pull over, ask her to go in the trunk and see if my phone was there. Luckily, she was like, I found your phone, blah, blah, blah. And she was nice enough to come back. So it was very, very sweet of her. She came back, but I had to wait like 35, 40 minutes or something like that. Um, but I finally got my phone. My driver, I'm like pretty sure he hated me. And I was like, I kept saying, I was like, I'm so sorry, but I can't leave without my phone. I'm so sorry, I can't leave without my phone. So by the time I left the Hamptons, it was like midnight. I got home around 2 a.m., I'm literally running off four hours of sleep. I worked all day today. And then I just came back from a meeting and I picked Rio up from school. So now it's about 5.50. And guess what I'm about to do? I'm about to take my clothes off. It's movie night with Rio. But before I do that, I'm going to sleep for 45 minutes because I am exhausted. <laughs> all that to say, I hope you guys had a blast hanging out with me. Super fun. Got a chance to see kind of like behind the scenes and what these events look like. Can we clap it up for Dior Skincare and their diversity? Like I was like, this is a vibe. I'm really proud of Dior. I'm like very happy to work with them and be one of their partners and like do so much with them. And they really got the memo on the diversity. Like I was like, this is a vibe. So I'm gonna end it here and I'm just gonna say, peace out. We can go over other things next week. Anything else you want to go over, let me know. If you're new here and you think I'm a vibe, please subscribe, comment down below, and I'll see you guys next week. Deuces, everybody. Have a good weekend.